Europe has just escalated the global tech war with China. The Dutch government has just taken control of Chinese-owned chipmaker Nexperia, triggering outrage in Beijing and sending ripples across the global semiconductor industry. And experts say, this is a moment India must pay very close attention to. On October 12, the Netherlands announced it had intervened in Nexperia, a major computer chipmaker based in Nijmegen that supplies components for cars and consumer electronics. The government cited concerns over the possible transfer of sensitive technology to Nexperia's Chinese parent company, Wingtech. This marks the first time ever that Amsterdam has used powers under a rarely invoked law known as the Availability of Goods Act. The move caused Wingtech's shares to fall by 10% in Shanghai on October 13. Now, the Dutch government hasn't taken ownership of Nexperia, but it will have the authority to reverse or block key management decisions that could harm national or European interests. Regular chip production at Nexperia continues for now. In response, Wingtech has hit back hard, calling the Dutch action excessive interference driven by geopolitical bias. The company accused some non-Chinese Nexperia executives of attempting a cloaked power grab to change the firm's equity structure through legal means. Wingtech says it's consulting lawyers and seeking government support to protect its legitimate rights and interests. Nexperia was once part of Dutch electronics giant Philips before being bought by Wingtech in 2018 for $3.63 billion. It produces basic chips like diodes and transistors, as well as more advanced wide-gap semiconductors, which are critical for electric vehicles, chargers, and AI data centers. Meanwhile, Wingtech confirmed that its chairman, Zhang Xuezhing, was suspended from Nexperia's board by an Amsterdam court order on October 6. An independent non-Chinese board member will now be appointed with a deciding vote, temporarily limiting Wingtech's control. The Dutch move comes amid growing Western scrutiny of Chinese tech investments. In Britain, Wingitech was ordered to divest ownership of a chip facility in Newport. And in 2023, the Netherlands reviewed Nexperia's acquisition of startup Noe over similar national security concerns. Tensions have also flared with the United States. Just last month, Washington added Wingtech subsidiaries to its national security blacklist, alleging that the company was aiding Beijing's efforts to acquire advanced semiconductor capabilities. Wingtech, already on the U.S. entity list since December 2024, maintains that Nexperia operates independently and complies with all global regulations. And while this battle unfolds in Europe and China, India is watching closely. Capital Mind CEO Deepak Shenoy says the Nexperia case is a wake-up call for India to build self-reliance in critical technologies. He said, this is exactly the kind of action India should study carefully. The Dutch took over a company because they didn't like the nationality of the shareholders. In the long run, they won't even let India acquire better tech. We must learn to build our own, from jet engines to sewing machines to chips. His comments come as country's worldwide race to secure control over semiconductor production, a sector that has become central to both economic and national security. So while the Netherlands says its decision was about protecting European technology, the message it sends is much broader. In a world defined by tech wars, control over chips may soon mean control over the future.